Kevin Connors again to talk to you about some more of your genetic pathway that we are looking at when we go over your review. So this is again my software, not um, and this is the the patient, uh, not the patient report, but the practitioner report. So it has a little bit more detail than what you can see in your report, but this is what we're looking for when we look at your detox pathway. So I think your report says detox pathways on here. And um, the first detox pathways that we look at are your SOD pathways. And I have a number of videos on this, so I won't go into details about any more with the SOD pathways, but they're extremely important. And they tie together with catalase in order to get rid of hydrogen peroxide, different oxidants in your body. It's very important. It's found right here on the pathway planner. Uh, we'll give credit to Dr. Ben Lynch and Seeking Health for this. Right here is your SOD pathway here. So coming out of methionine, you are actually making superoxide. This guy, hopefully you can see my cursor. Superoxide plays an essential role in your body. It helps kill pathogens. Um, you need, you know, so all this talk about, oh, I don't want any oxidation in my body and I need to use antioxidants. Well, in truth, if you don't have oxidation in your body, you will die. Well, superoxide is an oxidizing agent. It will attach to uh, bad guys and help kill them. But it's supposed to have a very short half-life in your body because if you got a bunch of superoxide roaming around with no bad guys, it attaches to your cells and damages your cells, and that's not good. And that's why we need genes like your SOD genes that make superoxide dismutase to grab onto superoxide and get rid of it. It converts it into hydrogen peroxide, and then with the help of the catalase genes, and the glutathione genes, this is the whole glutathione pathway right here, then you take uh, hydrogen peroxide and you convert it to water and you pee it out. So that's the process of getting rid of superoxide. Super, super important. Because if I have excess superoxide because I have gene defects with my SOD genes, I can end up with damage to my cells. But even worse, if I have excess this guy, that doesn't mean just no, it means nitric oxide. So if I have excess nitric oxide because of problems in um, either my uh, uh, biopterin pathway, it, I end up with uncoupled nitric oxide, and that's another lecture in itself. So if I have NOS defects, which you'll see way further down on your genetic report, um, I will have excess nitric oxide, this uncoupled nitric oxide. And if I have excess superoxide, they combine together to, to make this really bad guy, and that is the formulation for peroxynitrate. So peroxynitrate then damages your cells, damages your uh, vessel walls. This is what could lead to arterial sclerosis, heart damage, uh, which then leads to plaquing, which then leads to heart attacks. This is what can cause cancer. This is what can cause inflammation in the brain. So this is a huge player in my book for brain inflammation. And this is why you see this so prevalent with people with Lyme disease. And this is what can be the precursor for early dementia, Alzheimer's, and Parkinson's. So people with NOS defects or a chronic infection that will ramp up nitric oxide, like Lyme disease or a chronic H. pylori or something like that. Plus, SOD gene defects is a perfect storm for excess peroxynitrate, which is a perfect storm for a whole bunch of things that is a perfect storm for death. So we don't want that. So the SOD genes are very important, and so are the catalase genes. So you can see, oh, this sounds complicated, but they all fit together in this beautiful, beautiful picture. So maybe we'll stop there on this video because I'm promising to try to keep them short, and then we'll just keep moving through the SALT and the cytochrome P450 and the NERF uh, genes, all part of your detoxification pathways super important pathways if you want to stay healthy. So share this video with your friends. Um, watch it again if you want to understand it. Watch my other videos too. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.